How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. I may have a hot flash coming up, but I have my fan, so I'm good to go. Health-wise, to be honest, I feel almost back to myself. Uh, yes, the steroid, you know, stuff, I, I, I gained a couple pounds, 15 to be exact, but you know what, who's counting? Because I'm alive, I'm, I'm well, and I'm now a cancer, breast cancer survivor. So that is, I gotta count my blessing. Yeah. That is amazing news. Congratulations. That is yeah. that is so, so wonderful to hear. And I know so many people have been thinking about you and pulling for you. I mean, what would you say that you have learned about yourself during this process? I've, I've released what no longer serves me. And so that is allowing me to be way more transparent in the way I feel and not internalizing other people's um, you know, woo, woo, woos, you know? So a lot of time I felt like I was, I'm a fixer. So it was like, oh no, I'll handle it for you. I'll help you with this. And then you take on this stress for what purpose? Why, why? So I realized it's like, you know what? I'm going to be a little selfish. That was one of the first, um, first advice pieces of advice I received. And it was from Martina uh, Navratilova, who's Julia's wife. And so that was really honestly something that was hard to do, but now I'm doing it very well. Right. That is so good. I mean, what was it like hearing those words that you are a breast cancer survivor? I mean, ringing that bell, I was just kind of like, it, it, it was like time to let release. It was a release of just kind of like all this worrisome energy that I had and just this, you know, what if this and what if that? And just, I just felt so, so free. Yeah, it felt, it felt so freeing, yeah, to be me again and uh, in a new version of myself. So now it's kind of like I take no BS from no one, no mo. I <laughs> no love BS that. from no one, no mo. That's my, <laughs> that's my, that should be my new tagline. I take no BS from nobody, no. <laughs>